Hi guys, we are back with a new crafting idea. For making a pirate ship, first I am going to draw a pattern of the deck of the ship by taking 7 blocks on the paper. And another 7 blocks for the hull part. So these were the 2D patterns using which I'll be making a 3D base for the ship. So for internal support and linkage, you can see I'm measuring the breadth from the deck pattern and height from the hull pattern for making pattern of linking parts. Here I'm numbering the linking parts from 1 to 4. for peak, keel and rudder of the ship. Uh, don't worry, you understand the terms. Now with all these cutouts of patterns making the skeleton of the ship base, Follow the procedures really carefully. Now I'm turning the rudder, keel and four p part of the ship to the main part. Using the paper strips, I'll be covering the skeleton or the main part of the ship. to cut and paste the deck part of the ship. Deck part of the ship is basically the floor of the ship. Here I am giving details to the hull part and hence giving it a clean and realistic look.
carry on the work by giving more details to the ship. As for the mast of the ship, start by making sails first from white paper. Curve the paper for an exact sail look. Attaching the sail with the yard, and yard is the stick on which the sail is attached, and further attach the yard to the mast. Pasting the thread to demonstrate ties of the sails and the yards. Attach the sails with their respective masts. Tie more threads for better and minute details. This is the better version of hull or base of the ship as I've painted it. Now for the shrouds, take some threads and tie them together and stick it on the master's stone. I've made some details by tying threads from upper yard to the lower one in all masks. Also cross tied them from the yard of one mast to that of another. All 
also for making it more messy I've tied the thread from the base of the middle mast to the top of the foremast. I'm dry brushing using free hands by mixing brown and yellow paint for more rusty and old texture. So this is the final look. I hope you like it and please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more updates.